too. Tyler, I'm going to tell you something right now. You are going to make more mistakes and be wrong more often than not. It's just, it's a guy thing, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. But just remember, she loves you. Sarah, all the hard work and late night planning is done. Our day is finally here and you look amazing. Tyler, we made it. We finally made it to this huge milestone in our relationship. I have only been waiting 4,110 days for this moment. <laughs> the first time I saw you, Sarah, I instantly had a crush on you. You were at your cousin Tristan's house, who's one of my best friends, so I made him tell me all about you. You are the man that I have been waiting to marry all my life. I finally get to do that today. From there, we became friends until 2012 when I decided to ask you to be my girlfriend in the manliest way ever. Text message. <laughs> <laughs> Our journey together through these last 11 years have not been easy. We have watched each other go through good times, hard times, and times of heartache. We have been through it all and seen it all. We have been through more together in these 11 years than most couples go through in a lifetime. That is one of the many reasons I know you are the one. Over the years, we've been through so much together. We've watched each other graduate from high school. I watched you work very hard in college to be able to have the career you have now. Despite all the obstacles in your way, you never gave up. No matter what's been thrown at us over the years, we have always worked together, or worked through it together, and that's why I love you. You have remained at my side despite all the hurdles we have climbed together, no matter how hard those hurdles may be. The two of us have accomplished so much together through all these years, including buying our first home back in 2019, and all nine fur babies we have to occupy it. There is so much about this relationship and you that I love. You are one of the most generous and caring men I have ever met. I feel your love in the way that you make me laugh, the way you make me think, the way you care for others, buying me flowers every time I am sad, and the way you support me. I can't thank you enough for everything you have done for us. I promise, that, I promise to you that I will never give up on us, even when times feel impossible. Sarah. I promise to always listen to you, even when I know you're wrong. I promise to always love you and be there for you in whatever way you need me. I also promise to not get as mad at you when you leave all the lights on all the time, even though I remind you countless times. I vow to stay with you forever as a faithful husband in sickness and in health. I also promise to keep loving you even when you eat all my favorite snacks. But most of all, I promise to keep loving you despite the fact that when you think you are right, you are wrong. <laughs> I vow to be the best dad to our future kids and I promise to always love you, support you, and cherish you as my beautiful wife. I look forward to seeing where this new adventure takes us. I will be happy wherever I am as long as I have you by my side. You are my person, I am yours, I love you. Sarah, I can't wait to spend the rest of my days with you as my wife, I love you. Sarah and Skyler, having witnessed your vows for marriage before God, and all who are assembled here by the authority invested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. This is the moment we've all been waited 11 years for. You may now kiss your bride.
It is my pleasure and privilege to introduce to you for the very first time Mr. and Mrs. Franta.